afternoon, everyone. Welcome to the Wichita Ice Center. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, Kurt. Happy New Year, Kelly. We are minutes away from Springfield Spirit Varsity Hockey as Scott uh, welcomes us to the New Year 2021 with the festive screen there. First first game of the uh, 2021 it is. Of the year. And we've got a good one on our hands here, a good weekend as the Spirit set to take on the team that's sitting atop the standings right now, the Wichita Junior Thunder, as the Thunder come into this one with a record of 9-2-1. And, and as I mentioned, at the top of the standings, Spirit's coming in, I believe, in fourth place. Uh, a couple of games in hand, or actually a couple, yeah, a couple of games in hand, so uh, Spirit four points behind with a pair of wins could... Uh, tie the Thunder at the top of the standings. But, if uh, I'm not mistaken, the, the Thunder have played a couple more games they than have, us. Is that right? They Three have. Or four? Two more, I Two believe. Two more? Okay. So, should be, a, should be a good weekend here. Spirit <laughs> decked out in their CSDP third jerseys, which don't provide the maximum uh, amount of contrast with the dark jerseys of the Wichita Thunder, but yeah, it's enough uh, red out there it, that we should be able to pick it, things yeah, up. Yeah, it's not too bad with the red, and uh, their jerseys are, and uniforms just look entirely dark, so I don't think the blue is going to be a factor, but uh, yeah, probably not the contrast we're looking for. I bet the kids don't care. I think we'll be fine. Yep. We'll be just fine. Another thing, a little bit of a wrinkle as we are on the main ice surface here in Wichita, which is actually an Olympic size It rink. is. We were discussing that before the game. So an extra 15 feet of width to account for for the players on the ice. Lots of room to skate out there. And we'll see how that plays into the uh, action here as we go along. Well, as someone who has uh, attempted to play hockey on an Olympic ice, uh, the extra 15 is not good for, you know, 40-year-old players <laughs> or 50-year-old players. So maybe for the uh, 17 and 18 year olds, it won't be a big deal. Just over a minute to go in the warm up session and we'll be underway here in Wichita. Yeah. Not sure if there's any uh, Players missing on the weekend. We'll try to scan the. I know some bench. of our some of ours that we've missed uh, last few games. Matthew Skabinski's back in the lineup. Good to Glad see him to see out that. there. Uh, Gabe Kallenberger is back in the lineup. He, uh, of course, this is not his first game back. And uh, fully cleared for action. Hopefully, yep. See him on the ice. Scott, do you know if we have a full full bench? Do we have anyone missing? Nope. Scott, our stat man, says that we have a full bench. So. That's right, even if we did, we don't have any room for them on the, on the control board. So. so as the kids get their last little bit before the buzzer sounds, there it is. Looking forward to this game, Kurt. This, is, uh, this should be a good one. I'm excited about this. I'm excited about the level of play. Always want to take on those top teams and see where yep. you stack up during the season. And we've got a good one with this Wichita team. From what I understand, not a, I think it's a pretty balanced attack that they bring to the, uh, to the party where not uh, one or two superstar standout players. I think it's pretty, uh, pretty balanced from top to bottom. So Kind of similar to the spirit. You yeah. know, we've got scorers up and down our lineup. There's only, uh, there's only a few on our lineup that don't have a goal this year. Some of that has to do with uh, some runaway games we've had, but we've got a lot of people that can put the puck in the net. So hopefully we continue that throughout this play this weekend. Not sure if we're going to be doing lineups or uh, or anthem before this game. So uh, we'll see here in a minute. Looks like the kids are skating to the bench with the starting five behind the goalie and putting their helmets down. So they are anticipating a anthem. Interesting setup here with the benches right in front of us, directly in front of us here, yep. as opposed to the uh, opposite side of the rink. That's true. I wonder if that's to keep the uh, penalty boxes away from the fans. Of course, this is an arena that that uh, is sometimes used for a higher level of hockey, isn't it? Are you familiar with? Uh... Well, we were talking about that. Not sure uh, 
if the uh, Wichita Junior or the Wichita Thunder play here, if they, I think they must play at a, a, a Civic Arena downtown. They have another uh, arena here I that so. I think they play in, yeah. <laughs> All right, as our starting five come out, we've got our two D-man out at the blue line, Eric Life and Nick Daniger. And Coach BJ starting off with the white sweater line. Lovin' Worth and Kane. Kale Parker and Pipes the first game. That means Zane Lutzke tomorrow. So uh, I'm no homer, so I can easily talk over the Wichita lineup. That's all right. And so uh, I noticed that Tyler Kane got his hair cut. I, uh, I, I noticed I, that as well. Thought something was different on, uh, on his head. Doing some last minute, uh, last minute technical adjustments here. Maneuvering here to we'll give Sorry, Scott. to the mm. cameraman. Thanks. Yeah, Scott. we don't want to. We don't want to get in Brad's way. Oh. <laughs> All right, stand by for the national anthem, folks. National Anthem has been played and we are set for action here in Wichita. Of course, because the game just started. Because I made you move. Yeah, I made yeah we, move, we messed uh, something up. Caught my feet to the left <laughs> and it may have <laughs> taken the signal down. All right, here we are getting ready to play. Teams gather up around their goalies, get their lids on, get their legs going. Number 11, Smith there. That's a young gentleman that was just mentioned in the preem, who's apparently his mother tragically passed oh, away. Don't know any terrible. details to that, but hate to hear that. Yeah, absolutely. So, so thoughts and prayers go out to that family, for sure. 
So here we go, getting ready to drop the puck for 15 minutes in the first period here. And we are off. Puck is dropped, tied up in the center, picked up by Lovin. He takes it on the far side, sends it in deep. Down around the back of the goal line, picked up by Wichita. Wichita manages to tip it away. Oh, poked away by the Spirit. Picked up by Kane. Kane making things happen, sends it back into the corner. They rim it around, looking to send it around. Picked up by the Spirit. Now Lovin's got a little room, poked away by the Thunder. Thunder gets it sent out. A little bit of help there from the ref. Oh, both ways. So picked up by Lovin. Lovin sends it into the zone. Picked up by Wichita. Errant pass goes deep, picked up by Daniger here close. Back to the Thunder, Thunder try to regroup. Send it to the far side, got a little bit of space. Thunder still hasn't quite gotten it into the zone. They're off sides, picked up by the Spirit. Spirit sends it up to the blue line. Yes. Picked up by Major Carden. Major Carden's got it on the goal line. He's looking for some help, but they're making a change and he's not able to get it. Major Carden goes down, takes somebody with him. Now the lines have changed. Houston Brackett goes into the far side. Looking for some contact, picked up by John Brown. Big hit on John Brown at the blue line. Thunder pick it up, but uh, skipped over by Bussin, goes under his stick. John Brown comes in big, big hit by John Brown. Gets that center of gravity low and sends the Thunder to the ground. Picked up by the Thunder at the blue line. They just back in, backhanded in. Picked up by Carden. Carden backhands it out to Brackett. Out to the point. Oh, goes off John Brown's skate. Picked up by the Thunder at the blue line around the back of the, oh, can't quite get it uh, out of the zone there. So Bring John Brown back behind the net. John Brown still looking for someone to send it to. Picked up by Brackett, gets it out of the zone. Back into the corner. Bussin goes back to pick it up, but he's got some time. Spirit go for a line change. D to D pass to John Brown. John Brown just sends it across the red line. Picked up by Zahn Werner at the far blue line, he takes a hit. Back to behind the net. Zahn Werner putting some body on behind the net. Picked up by Andrew Johnson. He sends it into the near corner diagonal. Thunder pick it up, a lot of back and forth here. Looks like the team's just trying to feel it out, feel what each other's got for themselves. No major rushes so far. Haven't had a shot on goal yet in three minutes. Thunder take it back behind their net, trying to regrip. Looks like all the kids are trying to shake off a little rust on uh, getting the puck yeah, on their stick, Kurt. my thoughts exactly. Yeah. Just coming off a long break, finally get our first whistle here yep. on icing. But as you said, Kelly, really not much action either way as the feeling out process here. And the team's just trying to get their legs under them yep. once again. Get the feel for the puck. Had a couple of pucks bounce over sticks. Uh, and that's okay. You know, that's uh, not that's kind of to be expected. Uh, so right so away, uh, just some crisp passing off the sticks of the Wichita players. Looks like you can definitely see the uh, teamwork and the, and the skill, and uh, they're going to be a formidable opponent here for the Spirit. I would agree. I would agree. So a long, far pass out of the zone for the Wichita. Sent back in by the Spirit out of the neutral zone. Picked up by Wichita behind the net, trying to get it out. Kept in by Nickel Daniger. Nickel Daniger takes a big hit. Wichita grabs the puck, and here they come. Oh, puck way up Look into out. the... Into the bench area. We're gonna have to be, there's no nets here, Kurt. I just no realized nets. that we're gonna have and, to. And the uh, the plexiglass behind the bench is very is low. Very low. Very so, low. Yeah. If you're you honestly, your if you're toes. sitting in we're anywhere up. there, you're a good chance of getting a puck. Yeah, we're up high enough where we're probably uh, out of the firing line, but still, you got to pay attention at all Absolutely. times. Absolutely. Thunder take the puck in. It looks like they're gonna get a shot off. Big rebound coming off Kale Parker into the far corner. Thunder pick it up, send it up the bar, picked up by Will Peters. Will Peters up the far line, gets it out of the zone. Will Peters across the red line, sends it in deep. Most of the line spirit change. come over for a line change. We've got Worth and Kane back on the ice. Kane manages to poke it away, send it into the near corner, back behind the net. Rimmed around all the way, picked up by the Thunder. Oh, skipped over. John Brown's got it. John Brown brings it to the near side. He sends it for the pass to worth but they don't catch it and a little bit of a hit behind the play there that some of the people in the crowd think we should get a call but no call nice diagonal pass, pass. Uh, big outlet pass Kane coming in drops it back oh tipped away by the thunder nice little thought there by Kane though I'd like to see that Kane picks it up again in the far side he's looking for someone to send it to 
Kane fanning some room. Boy, that guy can dance, can he? That was nifty, a little yep, dipsy uh, spinorama. All right, picked up in the far wall by the Thunder, though, and they get a little shot here, and Kurt Bussinger, or Cal Bussinger, oh. oh, my goodness. Wichita Thunder player hits the brakes. Cal Bussin skates past him just by a foot, and he pulls up at the top of the circle, and he goes top side. As you can really see the uh, speed there of the Wichita player coming down the right side, and Bussin was trying to stay with him. Got a shot from fairly uh, fairly far oh, away, yeah. but left-handed shot beats Parker, and Wichita strikes first here and leads this one one to nothing. So puck is dropped at center line. Wyatt Worth sends it in deep behind the net. Tyler Kane chases, picked up by Wichita behind the net. Oh, intercepted by... Wyatt Worth, Wyatt Worth looking for some room. Tries to get in the middle there. Oh, a couple of chances there to get their sticks on it. Wichita managed to try to clear it, and they get it across the blue line, but it's going to be picked up by Lovin. Lovin's going to send it back up the wall here, and can't quite get it to Kane. Kane to Shemp. Shemp trying to get it to Worth. Oh, picked up by Wichita. A little opportunistic there, uh, but shut down by Brady Allen. Brady Allen sends it into the corner, but it's out to the, oh, 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 hanging out. Shot from the point, a little bit of a tip, a little bit of a rebound, laying there, but uh, managed to get swept away by Kale Parker. Big pickup by Shimp there in the far corner and comes all the way across the house to Lovin. Lovin sends it into the center. He sends it over. Brackett's going to pick that up. Brackett's got some room to play, but he's in the zone. Another and no one with him, spirit. but here he comes trying to look for someone to play, and he's looking for that pass. Tips, can't quite pick it up on the, on the shot is Gunner Beaver, but it's picked up in the neutral zone. Put down deep by the Spirit. Bracket goes into the corner to pick up for it. Major Carden going around back of the net. And Puck is caught behind the net. Wichita managed to send it out around the corner and picked up by Brady Allen. Good job by Brady Allen going in there to pick that up. Nickel Danner going over on the far side in the Spirit zone. Sends a big, deep, bouncing pass. Picked up by Major Carden. Major Carden's got one person to beat. Gets a shot off. I think that's the Spirit's first shot. Great job there. So. Great pass, outlet pass off the stick of Daniger off the boards. Finds Carden. Major able to use the defenseman as a screen. Sneaky little shot there. And a good save by the Wichita goaltender. <laughs> little uh, drop to the goalie's left here. Spirit have gone for a line change. Daniger gets it at the blue line. Oh, tries to pass it in, but uh, intercepted there. Kept in. Picked up by Johnson, the senior. Johnson can't quite get a shot off. Picked up by the Wichita Thunder, and they come out. And here comes Wichita, tipped by the spirit, Eric Life, but he managed to get a shot towards goal. Doesn't go in, though. Tipped by Johnson. Johnson comes up the near side. Johnson's got some numbers. Johnson takes a shot. Looking for the rebound. Had a couple of people crashing. Good job by Johnson to get it into the zone, going hard up the near, near wall. And he had people trailing and looking for the rebound, and the goalie managed to smother it. Had a Chased couple in. options in front, but not a bad, not a bad uh, decision there on Andrew's part, I think, to shoot that as pass wasn't really clear, and it's never a bad idea to get a shot on net, Absolutely. even though it's from the right side. Buck gets dropped, goes into the near corner, fought by with Werner and Johnson. Pokes out to the Wichita. They get a breakout pass. Bounced up the wall here. Goes around Brown. And now Morris on the Wichita has got a shot. Oh, my goodness. Nets off. There should have a whistle here, but a really good centering pass on a crashing on a crashing Wichita player. Beautiful. That would have been a beautiful goal. That was. Wichita, again, doing some nice uh, things offensively and looking for the open man. Uh, you can definitely see the teamwork developing there. And narrowly missing the net or the connection there to make it two to nothing. One thing we've definitely seen here, Kurt, is uh, Wichita, when they get a little room, they hit the Jets. Buck is dropped. Got some speed. Comes back to D. D bounces it off the near wall. Big diagonal pass into the zone. Pressure by Kallenberger. Puck comes out. Tipped by Wheeler into the zone. Wheeler bounces it off the wall. Back to Wheeler again. Wheeler to Brown. Brown up to Low. Oh, Low can't quite get his hands on it. Wichita picks it up. Back to Low. 
Then John Brown's got it. John Brown's going to get it, and he's going to get it out of the zone. Nicolo picks it up. A little bit of a scrum here on the near boards at the blue line. Wichita comes up with it. Oh, Wichita dances behind, dances around D. Luckily, Kale Parker's able to come out and some other that. Yeah. Buck just trickled away from the Wichita player, fortunately. And as you said, Parker saw it all the way, knew it was coming to him. He'd have a chance to smother it and able to force a face off in the spirit zone. We'll get a line change here. So Kane, Lovin, and Gunner Beaver out there. Looks like they got the set piece, oh, as sorry. we like to say, but yep. it didn't develop there. But Wyatt Worth able to pick it yeah, up. Yeah, absolutely. Came able to come over and, and pick it up. And he's got a shot. Bounced away by the goaltender. Picked up behind the net by Kane. Kane's looking for someone to sit to. Sends it back behind the net. He's got Worth. Worth's got some time. Worth. Worth going for a really wide angle shot there with a couple guys in front. Puck bounces off the glass and goes the length of the ice. Picked up by the D. Brady Allen grabs it, and he's going to look for nice Worth play. in the middle of the zone. Great pass by Brady Allen. Worth manages to dance around. Worth gets a shot off, and another bouncing shot uh, tipped by. Oh, puck is still loose. Puck is still loose. Slid in, still loose. Man. <laughs> so close. As oh you said, my goodness. the puck was just laying there in the crease area. There was Worth able to spin on it and get a was, shot on goal. Yeah, at least three shots there, maybe more. Uh, great job by Brady Allen to find the streak and white Worth in the neutral zone. He takes it in, gets a shot off, then a rebound shot by Lovin. Carden's going to take the shot here or the drop. He wins it back to Daniger. Daniger is going to take it into the corner. Oh, it's bounced up. Oh, picked up by Daniger. Here comes the Wichita into the zone. Good job by Brackett to pull back and play D. Smart heads up play by him. Pass tipped in by Brackett. Oh, just on this side, sorry, Beaver, just on the uh, this side of the red line. So that's gonna go for icing. Kelly, we have a spirit player shaking up on that last uh, scrum. And he's in the corner. We'll see who that is. It looks like it's John, John. Brown. He set, stands up. And John Brown did take okay. a couple of big hits over on the near wall. Just getting uh, some treatment from Kevin Johnson. And uh, who is that down there? Trainer? I think that's a trainer for Wichita. Okay. All right, Carden takes a drop, goes into the corner here, and goes around, comes out. Uh, Wichita still fighting for it. Carden comes up with it. He's got Brackett at the blue line. Brackett managed to snap off a shot, gets blocked by Wichita. Good job by the two of them to try to get something together. Bustin sends it back up. The wall goes into the near corner, chased by Carden, rimmed around all the way by the Wichita, and they've got some room to run here. Bustin goes, puts a big body on, and manages to squeeze that shot, that puck off. DDD pass to Wheeler, tipped by Carden into the zone. He goes for a line change. Andrew Johnson puts a little pressure on the puck. Just they send it deep into the zone, picked up by Wheeler. Wheeler tipped it in front of the house. Oh, stolen by Wichita. Uh, dangerous little pass there and dangerous little tip in front of the net. And Puck is out of the zone, fought for by Werner. This uh, Wichita team is definitely playing the body, Kurt. Yeah. A dangerous pass in front there, as you said, but uh, Spirit able to work around it. No harm, no foul at this point. And they get it out in the neutral zone. Zon Werner's got the puck. He skates it into the zone. He has got, oh, Ryan Robb with the catch and turnaround backhand shot. And, oh, then Andrew Johnson goes for the wraparound and the goalie managed to smother it. Nice work there by the captain, Zahn Werner, working that puck in front. And again, a little spinorama move there from Rob and they, Spirit, dangerous in front. Yep, they had some chances there. Starting to get some things going. Great pass by Werner, Rob managing to get it and whirl for a shot. Then he took a big hit off of that one. So, Werner takes the drop, picked up at the blue line by the Thunder, and they've got some numbers here. They've got Wyatt Shimp wisely lets the D take it, and here comes Andrew Johnson. He's got some room, but he's got no one with him. A wide angle shot gonna be picked up by Brady Allen. Brady Allen smartly just sends it deep in, and Johnson picks it up in the corner. He's looking for somebody. Crossing pass, can't quite find anyone, but Shimp is going to get there and get a shot. Big, wide open rebound 
sitting there, picked up by Nick Lowe and fought for, and the Thunder just send it deep into the zone for a line change. Couple of really good opportunities there, Kurt. Really like this shift from Wyatt Shimp so far, as you mentioned. Played that two on one perfectly, and then he snuck down and freed himself for a shot on goal. Really good effort there from Wyatt on this shift. Absolutely. A couple of dangerously tipped passes here down our own zone. Uh, Wichita managed to control the puck, but when we get our hands on the puck, we're doing some dangerous things with it as far as not possessing it. So looking to get this one out here. Big hit by Kallenberger there at the blue line. Puck goes back into the corner, back up the wall. Skibinski fighting for it on the near wall. Kallenberger trying to get it out, can't quite get it. Squirts out to Nick Lowe. Nick Lowe turns and he tries to put on the Jets nice. and he leaves big number 37 in his dust. Nick Lowe doing a good job of protecting the puck and he manages to center it. Good centering pass by Nick Lowe. Really good effort there. Absolutely. Nope, picked up by Nick Lowe again. Sneaking in there for that pass. He's looking for a centering pass. He's got someone in front. Nick Lowe looking for the backhanded pass. Does manage to get over there but tipped away by the Thunder. Good shift by Nick Lowe. Puck Spirit is out. Some good things. This can need to keep with the program, keep working. Here he is again, Nick Lowe with the puck and working on it on the near wall, but squirts out to the Thunder and they just send it in deep. And now they're chasing it. Number 15 by Wichita is going in there, but Nick Daniger's got some room and the stride. And now he's got F, uh, momentum and he sends it in. He chased it in behind the net and big hit there. No hand in the air though. So we we'll say that that was uh, a little bit close, but picked up by Lovin. Lovin can't quite get his hands on it, can't quite get it out, and here come Wichita. Oh, big hit by Daniger. That one was a dangerous one because he's tall and his arm definitely hit the helmet of that player, but uh, it was a clean hit. He just happens to be tall. Nickel playing with some fire on that last shift. He was uh, out there with purpose. Absolutely. So. Wichita managed to get into the zone. Uh-oh, got a little bit of a, oh, managed. <laughs> I'm not even gonna try to describe that, but we're lucky we didn't uh, get another one there. And Wyatt Worth picks it up and he sends it and here comes Gavin Lovin with the speed. Gavin Lovin's got a chance. Oh, and the glove. Great chance by Gavin Lovin. Him and Tyler Kane fighting for it in the neutral zone and they get it away. And Gavin Lovin gets a good shot off, but the glove comes out and wow. uh, gets shut down. Had a number there too, had uh, Tyler Kane hustling with him. Really good opportunity by those two to make something happen. So minute 47 left. Boy, that, that period went by fast, Kurt. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> 147 to go in the first period, one nothing score still. Eight to five shots on goal. Carden to take this drop out there with Brackett and Gunnar Beaver, I believe. Got Bussin and Brown at the blue line. And I'm not sure the what linesman talking things over at the spirit bench now goes over and talks to the Wichita bench. Looks like he's having a talk with the guys. Oh, the oh, linesman yeah. has a small wound on his hand. So, looking for a Band-Aid and a bandage from the trainer. I'm glad that that wasn't a, uh, a bench warning, Kurt. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie to you yeah. there. I was, <laughs> I was a little worried that he was over there talking to our bench. Ah, he's all bandaged up, ready to go. All right. So, here we go. Carden to take the drop. Springfield Spirit have stacked the, the crease. Puck goes around, back to Bussin. Bussin back to Carden in the corner. Carden can't keep a hold of it. Oh, does squeeze out. Pass Bussin. John Brown goes over to get it. John Brown with a diagonal pass over to Beaver. Beaver hits the brakes. Oh, gets poked away by Wichita. It sends it out the length of the ice. That is going to be icing. And it's going to come down. We're probably going to get a line change, I'm sure. Looks like uh, Wheeler and Chimp coming out for D. And looks like those forwards are going to stay. Uh, Beaver comes off. Well. Looks like uh, Beaver wanted to come off, and Will Peters is going to go on. Oh, Beaver back out. Uh, Will Peters is going to say, nah, man, you you gave up your spot on the ice. I'm going to take it. <laughs> so now we've got uh, Carden and Brackett and Peters. Carden, Brackett, Peters out there. And Carden takes the puck, manages to win it back, gets up to Peters. Peters making the most of his uh, stolen shift here. <laughs> And, uh, oh, almost got offside wow, there. Go. Picked up by, oh, Brackett 
goes over and swipes that away. Big hit by Brackett doing work in the corner. And Will Peters there to help pick it up. Peters again with it, and they send it back, but it goes to Brady Allen. Brady Allen sends it down behind the net and picked up by Peters with a little pressure and Zahn Warner over in the corner, picked up by Wheeler at the blue line. Back to Wichita, Wichita brings it out. Wheeler sends it into the zone, picked up by Wichita in their own zone, looking to set something up. Pressure by Zahn and Gage Robb. Comes into the neutral zone, picked up by Zahn. Zahn over to Gage Robb. Good pass. Robb takes it in down the right side. Oh, poked away by Wichita before he can get it off. Fought for by Andrew Johnson. Andrew Johnson tries to pick it up. And picked up at the blue line by a hustling Calvin Wheeler, but it does get smacked away by Wichita. Shimp sends it over to the blue line, tipped by Johnson. Johnson into the zone. All the way the length of the ice. No icing on that, I guess. I guess uh, there was plenty of people around that could have touched it. But anyway, Wichita gets it. A little nifty pass in front of the net. That's going to be the end of the period. Kurt, got to say, I only looked at the clock on that period twice. Yeah, it did go fast. It, was <laughs> a, uh, it wasn't uh, the, uh, the fastest period as far as on the ice at times it was a little draggy as we mentioned yep. you know both teams getting slow out of the gate but but no stoppage is a play right there was only three or four right whistles in the whole period it seemed like and wichita definitely uh starting to find their sea legs once again as yep. they uh able to strike once and almost had uh one or two more in the spirit kind of fortunate at this point to be down only by one yep. although they did have a golden opportunity on the uh breakaway from they, Gavin Lovin. And, and I'll, I'll give them some credit. They, they actually probably had three or four decent scoring chances. It's not like we're spending the whole uh, period down in our own zone. I mean, they're they're moving the puck around, but the Wichita team is definitely jumping on the puck, and if there's a if there's room, they are taking it. So, yeah. um, so just as we thought, we've got a good one on our hands here, and uh, it's going to be a battle the rest of the way. Teams talking right. things over at their benches, which again are right in front of us here. And we're going to turn play-by-play -play for the second period over to the dulcet tones of <laughs> Kurt Bussin. Thank you, Kelly. <clears throat> Teams will trade ends. Well, the lineups for the Spirit have been fairly normal. They have uh, a couple of changes that Coach Norman made in the last set of games have seemed <clears throat> to stuck. Uh, looks like he's got Beaver out with Brackett and Houston, or uh, Brackett and Carden. And he's got Rob out there with Zahn Werner, and that pairing seems to be working really well with Andrew Johnson. That that line made some things happen. And speaking of, that line will start us off here in the second period. We are underway as Eric Life will take the puck at his own blue line, sends it forward, picked up by Werner on the left side. Zahn done a shoot score or he's off the side of the net, sorry. Puts it off the side of the net as he was looking for the near side. Well, the net jumping like that certainly made me think he scored. Yeah. <laughs> Now back come the Thunder into the spirit zone as they'll pick it up and drop it off in the corner. Look to center in front. Oh, and just deflected away out of the reach of the Thunder forward back into the Thunder zone. Now it's picked up by Johnson from a bad angle. Looks to center it and stolen away from him. He'll work it in the corner once again as the Thunder will send it to the blue line and out. Life. We'll throw it to the other side of the ice and picked up by the Wichita player. Sends it forward. And taken there by Daniger. Backhands it forward and intercepted back by the Thunder as they'll dump it in the spirit zone. Will Peters on the ice now. Eric Life back for the spirit. Up the boards it goes for Johnson. It's in his feet and is able to work it forward. Picked up by Life once again. And his head man pass is intercepted. Dumped right back in by the Thunder as Daniger will collect it for the Spirit. Avoids a check and can't avoid the second one. Stolen off of his stick, set in front. And dangerous, almost a, an opportunity there by the Thunder, but back come the Spirit. End of the zone and a poke check there off the stick of Warner. And now sent back in as the Spirit tag up. Up the boards and out. Back to center ice. And here come the Thunder down the left wing side. Centering pass deflected away and back on the spirit. 
John Brown doing Calvert. a great job chasing that down. Oh, oh just offside as the Spirit oh, came that down was... with Kellenberger and Peters. But it's whistled down on an offside call. Yeah. How? And we'll get a face off just outside the Wichita zone. Kallenberger, Peters, and Skabinski on the forward line here with Bussin and Brown on defense. Puck back to Brown as he'll dump it in. Settled behind the net by the Wichita goaltender. And Spirit with four check on. But the Thunder able to ring it up the boards. Held in by John Brown as he battles along the half board. Now back out with the puck come to Thunder. End of the zone. Still in front, serving pass and a save as the Thunder are dangerous once again. Now puck along the far boards as a scrum of players will battle for it. Back to the blue line, held in. Slap shot and a save on a screamer from the point as Parker puts a glove on it and we'll get a face off. In the replay here, you see a quick little snapshot. Kale Parker flashing the glove above the uh, above his body and snagging that one out of the air. The Worth loving Kane linebacker on the ice. As Spirit will try to break it out, intercepted by the Thunder and a shot from the slot and a save once again by Parker. As kale has been forced to make a couple of big saves. Two Wichita players managing to just park in front of the front of the net there, and that's uh, opening up some shots. Puck oh, one by the Thunder once again, and a shot on goal. Rebound is cleared out of there, picked up by the Spirit. Back they come. Cross ice pass for Lovin. Can't go around a man, and stolen away from him. Now up the boards as the Thunder want to reverse things. They'll try the other side with it. Uh, it's back, they come to center ice, intercepted by the Spirit. Lovin fights off a check, and now it's poke checked away from him. And Brady Allen will pick it up at center ice. Brady dumps it in, and he gets dumped to the delight of the Wichita fans. <laughs> now puck into the zone. Outlet pass as back come the Thunder. Big check there. Brady Allen just gets in the way. Nice job oh, there by Brady. And, and the... Uh, we get a whistle again, an offside call. I missed that one. Well, uh, Brady Brady went for the big hit, and number 88 just just happened to get the hook on uh, Brady's skates there. So he, uh, that looked like a veteran move to me. <laughs> <laughs> so face off with Carden, Beaver, and Brackett on the ice now for the Spirit. As Wichita will go off the glass and held in momentarily. Bouncer at the blue line, now settled by the Thunder. And back they come into the spirit zone as they fight off a check. Now into the corner. As he looks to center, it's still on the puck. And finally stolen away by the spirit. Back comes Carden. Can't as quite get the... The Thunder player able to get a stick on it. Now back come the Thunder into the spirit zone. Centering pass from the corner, nobody home and held in at the blue line. Now dumped down low behind the spirit net, below the spirit net, picked up by the Thunder. As pressure on by the spirit. Now a oh. pass off the side of the net. Back to the point, a bouncer, and out of the zone, but picked up by the Thunder. They'll dump it right back in. Daniger back for the spirit, as he'll ring it up the near wall and out of the zone. Thunder on it once again as they'll send the puck forward. As icing is the call. Looks like it may have hit a spirit stick, but it is an icing call. Yeah. And we'll get a face off back in the, the Thunder zone. Smart player, Houston Brackett, or uh, maybe it was Gunner Beaver, but one of them giving it the old tap on the ice pass to me. Yeah. And uh, boy, if that worked, that'd have been pretty. <laughs> Zahn Warner set to take the draw for the Spirit, and it's back to the point. Brown tries to settle it, can't keep it in. Dumped in on a delayed call as the Spirit will tag up. 
And the Thunder up the far boards. It's intercepted by the Spirit down the right side and the shot. And that looked like it was off the side of the net as well. As the Thunder will try it once again, they're able to clear it out this time. Back to center ice and the dump in pass goes over the boards at the bench area. And we're gonna face off for that. 9.45 to go in the second period. Spirit still trailing in this one, one to nothing. As Warner set to take this draw once again with Robin Johnson. Puck back for John Brown, he'll dump it in. Hustling after it is Warner, and he will catch up to it. He's on, on the putt, centering pass, but it's intercepted. And back comes Wichita down the left side. They'll gain the red line and dump it in. Played there by Parker as he's able to clear it all the way to the blue line now. Mm -hmm. Backhanded out by Warner, but intercepted and sent right back in. This time Parker will settle it for Warner. Outlet pass. And I know that that was a breakout pass, but boy, that's little, dangerous. Little too much mustard on that one as it came right back into the danger zone and almost an opportunity there for the Thunder. Now below the net, nifty move nifty there by Bussin. By. As Cal still looking for it, now he'll circle with it. Bussin. Another He's nifty able to move dump there. It out. And Thunder have it there as they'll move the puck forward. Bouncer settled by Brown and he'll skate behind his own net. Looks to set things up. John up the boards for Rob, and he's got a man on as he'll get help from Brown once again. This time, John will go to the other side with it, and Andrew Johnson's got room to skate. Johnson, end of the zone, around a man. Looks to center it, and no looks one for there. to center it too, and it's blocked away. Now, Will Peters will drop down and help out, but it's stolen away by the Thunder, and back they come into the spirit zone. Now behind the net, Bussin squeezes his man to the, man to the boards and he's able to put, push the puck to the blue line but held in. And now shots deflected wide, still on the puck. Oh, and a good stick there by Shimp to prevent that shot from getting through. And now a bouncer to the side of the net is smothered by Parker. And we'll get a stoppage and line changes for both teams here with 7.55 to go in the second period. Another good shift there by Wyatt Shimp. Uh, really, really becoming a standout defenseman here. Doing some nice uh, things with the in shift this game. back to D. Now off the draw, puck taken by Allen as it's held in at the point by the Thunder. Actually, it's not held in as we get a delayed offside here, and the Spirit will carry it out. Outlet pass is too hot to handle all the way down the ice and we'll get a stoppage for that on the icing call. Just over the stick of Will Peters. Good thought there, but. Yeah, it was the right pass. Uh, just a little hot and a little high. So, of course, the fact that it came near someone didn't, it made it be an ice, not an icing call a few shifts ago. I always feel like if you're, if you're attempting to make a pass, right. it shouldn't be an icing call, yeah. but they don't see it that way and blow the whistle and here we go. Now Brady Allen behind his own net. He's got a man on up the boards for Peters. He's able to deflect it out. He'll chase it down at the blue line. He's taken down, and we're going to get our first penalty of this game. As interference? Yep, probably going to be to the bench. Spirit will try to maintain possession, but it's played by the Thunder. And yep. we get an interference call as yep. Will Peters was taken down at the red line. Well, a good job by him to keep his feet good moving and hustle there. towards that puck. Uh, regardless of, of, you know, how viable it was to get to it, which he was going to fight through that and uh, force that guy to either foul him or let him go. So good job by Will to keep his feet moving and show that hustle. So we'll get a look at the Springfield power play for the first time in this game. Power play unit number one on the ice with Kane, Love, and Worth and Werner and Brown. Now it's back for Zahn. Slap shot from the point, deflected wide. Now in the near corner, battled for by the Spirit and taken by Kane, back for Brown. And now right back for Tyler in the corner. Tyler looks to work it in front and a shot. And save is made, no rebound. So quick. As Tyler uh, had room to move it in front. Replay here, he had room, skated it in, had lots of time, saw a little hole there, but he also had Wyatt in front of the net there trying to distract the goalie, so. 
get another crack at it here. This, this is a good shot with the ice. Uh, we went it back to Zahn for the quick shot, but that didn't happen. <laughs> but does come back to Brown, though, as he's able to hold it in over for Warner. Zahn, he's got room to skate. His shot is oh. deflected wide right to the stick of Worth. Back to the point now. Oh, and Warner fans on it. And the Thunder able to ice the puck down. Played there by the Spirit, and back they come for Zahn. Warner stops. He'll skate it into the zone. Round the defense. And now off the boards, back to the point for Worth. Up high, Wyatt now down low to the right side for Kane. He'll circle with it, looks for a play or a pass or a shot. Now the left side for Zahn. Warner, oh, and a sliding block there by the Wichita player. Nice move there. Back for Brown, who shoots. And a glove save is made by the Wichita goaltender. Good shot Good by Brown there. there. By he, the had, spirit. he had lots of room out there, had some space, had a little bit of a screen. It's a great shot to take. That goalie has shown that he's got the glove, though. Yeah, so far he's been up to the up to the, t the challenge. Big guy, number 70, fills that uh, cage. And the spirit will have to keep firing pucks away. 46 to go in the penalty. As Not sure what that was. Carden, Johnson, and Rob on the ice with Brady Allen and Nickel Daniger. Puck now behind the net, center in front, mm. and stolen away by the Thunder. Oh, that's that's going to be high stick. Now, puck played by the Spirit, and we're going to stop us for that as the puck was played by a high stick. Faceoff <laughs> will come in the Spirit zone. Thirty-three to go in the penalty, and off the draw. Puck sent out to neutral ice by the Spirit, taken there by Wichita. As uh, so chased by Daniger, to long legs. Send it down once again, and now behind the net. Look out here, as Parker was going to go to play it, but here's the replay. Not to so yeah, the he had some pressure. Far side of the net, wide open, and a wraparound effort came, but I'm not sure how that one stayed out. You know, he managed to get his leg out really wide and I guess catch the thing there, but, uh, you know, a little bit of a lackadaisical play on chasing that down on a shorty goal yeah. attempt, so. And line change now for the Spirit as the power play unit number one back on the ice late in this penalty. Now a shot from the point is deflected high. Look out into the into the mezzanine area there. Did yeah. it ever come down? <laughs> I don't see anybody uh, wincing in pain over there, so I don't think anybody got hit by that puck. Deflected by the Wichita player, so the faceoff will come outside the spirit zone. 10 seconds left in the penalty. <clears throat> now off the draw, puck is in the air, bouncer settled by the spirit. Back they come now, headman pass, but it's deflected away. As the penalty now over, Wichita back to even strength. Puck in the Wichita zone as it's held in at the point. Kane on it for the spirit in the cor corner. Now back for Lovin and back for Kane. Centering pass is deflected away and Wichita able to dump it back out. This one will go for an icing as we are now back five on five. Spirit with a little chance to take advantage of the penalty kill hangover. The Wichita was still very much playing like a box and one there. Gave them a little room to move it around, but they couldn't take advantage and get a shot off. So line change here is Kallenberger low and Skabinski on the ice for the Spirit. Life and Wheeler, defensive pairing. Uh, off the draw, it's won by the Thunder and chipped off the boards and out. Hustling to it is we uh, Calvin Wheeler and backheaded off over the plexiglass. Calvin agrees. Into the crowd. Calvin agrees. <laughs> we'll get another whistle and a face-off upcoming in the spirit zone. Out of the zone. 
Schallenberger will stay on the ice to take this draw. And it's one back for Eric Life. Sends a puck forward, but intercepted by the Thunder. Put Ooh, on net and dangerous. save there. As Parker was screened a bit, but able to pick that puck up. Now up the far boards, but off the stick of the spirit player Skabinski and held in by the Thunder. Skabinski has it again, and this time a headman pass. Nice pass for Kallenberger. Gabe's got room to skate down the right side. Centering pass for Lowe on his backhander. Oh, nice. And a save is made by the goaltender once again as Lowe got spinned around, was on his backhand, able to get a pretty solid wood on that backhand I shot. I think so, yeah. It was a, a good little backhand shot. Uh, it just happened to be between five different. Uh, that was low on the shot. So. Now a line change for the Spirit as Carden will take this draw. And it's won by the Thunder as they'll send it up the boards and do the blue line and out. Bouncing puck is picked up and skated in the Spirit zone. Backhander wide. And now along the half boards. Stolen away by the Spirit. Outlet pass for Bracket. Houston Bracket. As he tries to go around the oh. defender, unable to do so. Good defensive play there by the Thunder. Stolen away by the Spirit once again. We've got a man in front of him. Oh. Get it to him. It's Cardinal. That's going to be a penalty. Yep. And we're going to get a stoppage for another penalty. It's slashing call. Huh. Interesting. I didn't really see that. I, I can see the penalty yeah. being called, but. Uh, so Spirit will get another crack at the power play here as they are able to draw another penalty. Power play unit number one on the ice once again. And off the draw, it's won by the Thunder and cleared out. Thunder doing a nice job so far in this game, winning lots of face -offs. They are, and hustling back and Winning those 50-50s, looking for a centering pass. <laughs> now John Brown able to fight off a check and sends a puck forward. It's Kane into the zone on the left side. Winds it up and a shot loose in loose, front. Still loose. loose as Kane picks it up. Back for Worth. His shot is blocked. Now Brown with it. It was a bouncer. He couldn't get good wood on it. <laughs> and Thunder able to dump it back out. Flurry of chances there for the Spirit. Uh, and John Brown hustling back in his own zone for the puck. Oh, John, head man pass, but it's out of the reach of Worth, and it's intercepted, skated back in by the Thunder, and a shot from a bad angle was sailing wide, but Parker puts a glove on it, and we'll get a whistle. Face-off upcoming in the spirit zone with 1.11 to go in the penalty to the Thunder. 2.51 to go in the second period. Boy, Kurt, as fast as the first period went, this second one seems maybe to be dragging. Faster. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I don't, I don't and know. And maybe that's just because I'm not. <laughs> maybe it's whoever's talking as yeah. the one that has to deal with it. So Now a puck off the draw. It's taken by the Spirit, but stolen away. Dumped back down low. As now Brady Allen will have the puck up the far boards. Pass doesn't connect, and it's held in by the Thunder once again. Uh, still work it behind the net. Looks to center it. Settled there by Daniger. And he'll dump it to the blue line. Uh, Spirit bottle up here a little bit on this power play. Now finally they're able to work the puck to center ice. Daniger stops, dumps it down low. And Carden will catch up to it behind the net. Looks to center it, wrap around. He scores! Oh, he got it! Major Carden works the wrap around once got again. <laughs> Major got it, and yeah. the spirit strike on the power play. You can see it developing there. He sure could. He likes it behind the net he there. He loves <laughs> that wraparound, and it was there for him. He's able to bang it home. The, the post, the net came off its post, but it was after the puck had crossed the goal line. Referee single goal right away, and we are tied as the spirit strike on the power play. Nice to see that. Well, that's, uh, you know, this, this game certainly hasn't been lopsided. It's been really evenly played. It feels like the, the Wichita Thunder have been able to skate a little better than us and, and jump on those things, but we've gotten our chances. And so the boys kept kicking it back there, and uh, Major was able to take advantage of that opportunity. Now back underway as he pucked to the blue line and delayed call here as the spirit forced to tag up. 
Now taken by Worth as he'll work it into the oh, zone. Oh, taken oh. off the puck, no call. And now Tyler Kane on the puck, cross ice for Wheeler. His shot, and oh, the score! Yes! Calvin yes. Wheeler! Off the pass from Tyler Kane. Puts it on net, the goalie gets Tyler a piece King. of it, but it sails over his shoulder into the net. Very quickly, the spit strike again. And it's off the stick of Calvin Wheeler. Just uh, just caught a little bit of the glove off the goalie and trickled over his head and into the, into the net. So, got to love family, seeing that. Uh, just to our left here as we broadcast, they're all hooting and hollering. Losing, and losing their minds. <laughs> as they should be. So just like that, the spirit go from trailing by a goal to leading by a goal. And off the oh, puck again. Oh my goodness, another and opportunity. And a shot off the stick of Gage Robb. And a good save there by the Wichita goaltender as they nearly, nearly miss making it three to one. 1.30 to go in the second period. As the faceoff will stay in the Wichita zone. Zon Warner set to take it. Rob skates over to stack the crease. Now off the draw. Warner able to work it free and puts a shot on net. Quick little Another replay here. By the Wichita goaltender. Warner sends it over. Andrew Johnson mm -hmm. trying to sneak in there for that rebound. We'll see what Warner wants to do with this one as puck is back to the point. Shemp will hold it in, dumps it in the corner. Warner there for the spirit, centers it, but it's stolen away by Wichita and worked it to the corner. Now bouncer settle in the corner, played by the spirit. Johnson works it in front, shot on goal and a save. Rebound. Cleared to the corner. Warner will try to keep it in. Picked up by Wichita, they'll skate it out. Now an outlet pass is stolen away by the Spirit and dumped back into the Wichita zone. Now under a minute to go in this second period. Delayed call there as the Spirit tag up. Now oh. loose puck taken by Rob. Gage uh, doesn't have an uh, angle for a shot. Didn't, didn't see uh, Andrew Johnson coming in to help him, so he was just trying to buy some time and let his team get in there. Great now, job by Rob to jump on that. Back in the spirit zone, outlet pass is out of reach of Johnson and goes all the way down into the Wichita zone. 25 seconds left. As both teams completing some line changes here. Up the far boards, intercepted by the spirit. Back they come with numbers. Now it's for Warner. Oh, oh, oh my, my goodness. made and just unable to get a stick on it was Brackett. Now six seconds to go in the period. Flurry here late by the Spirit. And mercifully for the Thunder, it comes to an end, the second period. Well, let's go back to that last little series there, Kurt. Great job by Brackett and Werner to uh, pass the puck back and forth to each other to try to set something up. And yeah, that rebound was fat. Boy, you almost wish, you almost, uh, wish there was no uh, break here for the ice resurfacing with the momentum the Spirit had. Building in that second period, we'll see if they can keep that going after the break, but really nice flurry uh, there in the uh, latter parts of that period. Absolutely, some, uh, you know, good hustle. The guys kept uh, kept their feet moving, and you know, they had chances all throughout the first and second period, so you gotta figure that those are gonna start coming in. Their goalie was playing great, and so you gotta give him all the credit in the world. But, uh, you know, the, the, the boys kept pushing it in. Yeah, the shots on goal for... are 17 to 11, so you'd like to see us get some more shots on goal. But I don't think that accurately reflects how many times we had opportunities down in the zone. So, uh, I, you know, I, we're getting the opportunities, and a couple of them went in, so got to like those breaks. So we'll take a break here for second period uh, ice resurfacing and be back your way in uh, roughly 15 minutes or so. Once again, uh, after two periods, two to one spirit.
everybody. We are back at the Wichita Ice Palace. What, are, what, what is this? Palace sounds good. We'll palace, go yeah, we'll go with Palace, okay. Got about a minute before the players are let back on the ice for a quick, quick skate around and uh, the refs are clearing some things out in front of the net. Looks like we've got some ice build up there. And uh, we'll start the third period. Quick recap here. Uh, fairly evenly skated. Uh, Spirit haven't got quite as many shots as the Wichita Thunder. And the Wichita have definitely played a very aggressive game, Kurt. But, you know, they jumped out to a 1-0 lead. And then in the spirit of uh, about 30 seconds, Spirit took the lead. Yeah, they did. Late in that second period, all the momentum tilted toward the Spirit. And... As we talked about before the break, maybe uh, maybe you kind of would like to see the spirit keep going in that yep. and uh, pour it on a little bit. So we'll see how it shakes out after the intermission, if the spirit can continue with that momentum and keep things going, or we'll have to see how it all shakes out. But still uh, much to be decided in this game as it's just a one goal game and 15 minutes to be played. and. Spirit will have to come out solid defensively and build on that and see if they can extend this lead a bit. Absolutely. So, again, 17 shots by Wichita, 11 by the Spirit, and I don't think that accurately reflects the uh, opportunities the Spirit had, but you would like to see him shoot some more, and you'd like to see him come out and, and control the puck a little bit more. We always talk about that. A couple of errant passes and errant bounces are, have given the Wichita a couple of opportunities. Yeah, but, first uh, and foremost, you got to shore things up in your own zone. Like yeah. you said, be efficient out of your, out of your uh, own zone on the breakout. Make good, solid passes, not in skates, not behind a player. Make the right pass. If you don't have a pass, go high off the boards and out. Take an icing if you have to. Slow things down. But playing with the lead now, coming into the third period as opposed to behind it, you still so, want to keep your foot on the accelerator, but absolutely, be smart about absolutely. it. Absolutely, and uh, want to see how uh, how this goalie reacts to giving up a couple of simple ones. Yeah. You know that that second one, he was almost kind of rattled by the way it went in. So you know, we'll see how that goes. Uh, and they did. It's still the same goalie. They do have a backup goalie, but they've stuck with the same one. And uh, looks like we've got the white sweater line, Lovin, Kane, and Worth out there like to see this line get going. They've had some opportunities. And here we are dropping the puck, everybody, and it's on the ground, and Wichita takes possession, sends it in the zone. Daniger sends it back to neutral. Fought with by Lovin. Picked up by Kane. Kane up to Wyatt Worth. Wyatt Worth's got some room. Wyatt Worth, oh, just loses the puck in front. Picked up by Lovin. Lovin fights for it in the corner here. Comes up the near side by Wichita. Wichita tries to send it out. Wichita across the rink they take it into the zone but picked up by delayed blue, call there yeah. the, uh blue offside, lights. offside. Hmm, interesting call. would have thought that would have been whistled a little bit yeah mm -hmm. yes he did but it was it was uh was the whistle was the shot after the goal or i think the shot was before the whistle because it was a really late whistle on the icing not sure about that quick line change here bracket carden and gunner beaver Picked up by Carden, sent uh, in a little mix-up there. Gets chunked in by Wichita and chased into the near corner. Wichita picks it up, looking for that centering pass. Interrupted. Oh! Quick, quick shot by Wichita. Bad bounce. Go ahead, Kurt. No, just a great centering pass there. Eric Life uh, engaged with his man in front, but... He's just able to fight him off and does a little spinnerama, puts it on his forehand and buries it. Eric did a good job of blocking that Not first much centering he could do. pass. It was just a good, good pass and a good play by the yeah. Wichita player. And just just turned and snapped one off. And good things happen when you throw the puck at the net. So it's now a tie game. Puck is dropped. John Brown takes up the far wall. Spirit managing to get it, put it in. Chased by Brackett. Puck comes into the neutral zone. Back into Wichita zone. Wichita tries to bring it out. Here comes Houston Brackett putting a body on. John Brown trying to fight for it. Puck goes back to Wichita, fighting for it. Brackett comes up with it into the zone. 
Racket still fighting for it. Whiffed by Wichita. Puck is out of the neutral zone, and the length of the ice should be icing. It is. And we'll come back for a faceoff in the Wichita zone. Very early in this first, uh, third period, back to an even 2-2 game here. So as we talked about that momentum tilting toward the spirit, well, it's gone now as Wichita is able to find the equalizer. Like ESPN uh, – voice Bomani Jones says he doesn't believe in momentum yeah and so I'm going to stick with that uh, because I think this is really a 1-1 game both teams have earned a cup uh, earned a goal and both teams got a fluky goal so this is a 1-1 game with 13 minutes left to play and let's see if the spirit can get something going here batted around in the neutral zone big hit by Shimp Brady Allen skating with it oh just manages to fight off the Wichita player takes a big hit at the blue line Ryan Robb gets it. I'm sorry, Gage Robb gets it. Sends it into the far corner. Picked up by Wichita. They send it around in the near corner. And they are trying to bring it out. And picked up by Shemp. It's in the neutral zone. Picked up by Wichita. And they've got a little room here. Number 63 manages to get in. Oh, that was a knee. They're going to call Shemp for a knee yeah. on that one. Spear are going to go to the yep. penalty box for the first time in this game. Yep. Kneeing is the call. Yeah. As did they indicate it? Yeah. 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 I can't can't say I blame them for that. That. Uh, yeah. I think uh, that one is a good call. Unfortunately. Yeah. Uh, I like that. I like that. Why was trying to go out there and meet him? That was the right move. Uh, just using the knee is always a bad idea, but it was the right move to go out there and make that contact. Knee. <clears throat> Oh, Tyler Kane goes out there and gives nice up his body there. for the block. Puck comes back in. Nickel Daniger sends it the length of the ice. And it's going to be chased by Tyler Kane. Tyler Kane goes out there to get it. And he manages to meet the person at the goal. And Tyler Kane's going to do what he does, which is get a little get a little space here. Tyler Kane comes up with the puck. Tyler Kane looks for Lovin. Lovin sends a big shot in, but it goes just a little bit wild. Picked up by Wichita, and they get it behind the net. Again, Tyler Kane sticking around for some pressure. And they still haven't gotten it out of the zone yet. Picked up by Lovin. Lovin's got a little room. And he tries for the shot. Rebound still picked up by the Wichita, and they bring it out. But good job by this line to keep the puck in their zone and get some shots off. Wichita goes around back behind the net and sends it to the far near side. He's going to turn and get a shot off and blocked by Kale Parker, poked away by Wichita. Wichita's got possession, sends it to the far side, gets a wild shot off from a bad angle, and Kale Parker flashes the leather there. Well, great forechecking by the Spirit as they're able to bottle in the Thunder for the first part of that power play. And Wichita finally able to work it into the spirit zone and got a couple of quality chances scoring uh, or good quality shots on net. Kale Parker able to pick them up and make the saves. All right, Carden and Worth out as forwards. Bussin and Brown as D. Wichita picks up possession. They're trying to look for some opportunity to get a shot off. Back to the blue line. Big shot. Picked up. Big rebound. And here comes the puck. Skated, pressure by Carden. Carden's going to go into the corner with it. And Wyatt Worth's going to go over to the far corner, and he's going to pick it up. He's going to, oh, picked up by Wichita. Poked away by Carden. Wichita picks it up again. They get it into the zone. And intercepted by Carden. Carden sends it the length of the ice. And they're going to send it. Carden skates off, looking for someone. Ten seconds left in the penalty here. With 11 minutes left to go in the game. Wichita brings it out. And headman pass. Oh, just gets around Bussin. And nice pass over. Oh, look out. Big bounce off of Kallenberger skate. Whew. Spirit dodge a bullet there. As yes, they do. Deflected off a defenseman back towards the net. Heads up play by Kale Parker to pick that puck up. Able to squeeze it. Just Thanks. as the penalty expired. So we're back five on five. That was actually uh, uh, out. Gabe Kallenberger coming in off the bench trying to corral it with his foot, send it up to his skate, but it just happened to happen to go a little too far there. Like you said, luckily, Cal or Kale was able to stop it. Kallenberger takes the drop, wins the puck over to 
the far wall, comes back over diagonally, picked up by Skibby, Skibby up the near wall, picked up by Kallenberger, he gets it out, picked up by Peters, Peters bounces it, deflects it up into the air, picked up by Wichita, they send it into the zone, Wyatt Shimp back on the ice, and he sends it high and up off the glass, but it gets batted down in the near corner, Shimp doing work over there, here comes Kallenberger to come help him, Puck comes out, picked up by Skaminski. Skaminski sends it up to Peters. Peters can't quite handle it in the neutral zone. Tipped over to Wichita, picked up behind the net. Ooh, big hit from behind on Kallenberger, but he jumps right back up. Picked up on the far wall by Peters. Peters main session, bounced off, off the wall, back to himself, back into the neutral zone by Wichita. Wichita's got a little bit of room, but they can't handle it. And they just backhand it in and they go for a line change. Picked up by Shimp. Shimp up to the hash mark. Skibinski looking for the cross ice pass. Picks up Peters in the center. Peters gets it across the blue line. Peters looking to the far side, looking for someone to pass it to. Poked away by Wichita. Near side to Johnson. Johnson back into the corner. Johnson traps it on his skate in the corner. Big fight. Oh, I believe Johnson's going to go for this one. Um, hands up in the air. And touched up by the spirit. Johnson's going to go. Interference is the interference, call. I don't know huh? if I agree with that one. If I, anything, maybe a roughing call. Yeah, I saw his arms come up. but Players uh, were right there on the puck. Yeah, when you got four guys fighting for it, there's all kinds of interference. You can't yeah. just call someone, I wouldn't think. But, uh, so, unfortunately, the spirit will go to the box for the second time in this game. So, been a pretty clean game so far. Just a smattering of penalties yeah. on each side, but nothing serious. So, Let's get out of this one clean and move on. Puck goes, get, drop is taken by Werner. Werner gets the puck. Werner out to Life. Life sends it the length of the ice. Chase down by Daniger. Daniger putting a little pressure on. He skates away. Pressure by Gage Robb. Gage Robb still chasing the puck. Wichita brings it in. They get it into the zone. Intercepted by Gage Robb. Nicely done. He sends it the length of the ice. And he skates down to pressure him a little bit. Picked up by Wichita. They're looking to set it up. Gage Robb with the pressure. He's skating with the puck. And they managed to get it into the zone. Picked up by Life. Nice check Big there by hit. Life. Taking that player off the puck. Ooh, dangerous through the center of the ice. But the puck finds its way down. Yes, it does. Picked up by Wichita. But again, pressured by Robb. Robb sticking close to the puck here. He lets him set it up behind the net. And that's just wasting time, which is okay with him. Now left pass to the near side. Slow pace here on this uh, penalty. They are looking for the wide opening, but uh, picked up by Spirit. They rim it around, picked up by Wichita. Wichita rims it around back. Oh, here comes, oh, Werner has it, but can't quite get it. Here comes Wichita with the shot. Big rebound over to the far side, and the pace is picked up here. And Puck's up and out of play over the Pexiglass. Yeah, a little lackadaisical there at the blue line by Captain Zahn Werner. And puck intercepted by the Thunder, held in, dangerous. Zahn able to collect it again, but outlet clearing effort goes over the boards. Whole, whole, whole skate there was a little lackadaisical by both teams. Yeah. They seemed like they were catching their breath. Drop taken by Major Carden, poked out in the neutral zone, back into the defensive zone and Wichita has definitely picked up the pace of their skating. John Brown puts a body on. Oh, big hit taken by Carden. Carden jumps back up and that is going to be a that is going to be a penalty on number 66 for Wichita. I'm saying what is the call here? And it's going to be a roughing call. Roughing call. Brought That'll his arms up. Even into, things up. Yes, it will. For the next 24 seconds. Four on four, and then the Spirit will get a power play. Major Carden skating off with a smile mm -hmm. on his face, though, so we're going to call that a win. You said so, he wanted to mix things up in this yes, one. He he <laughs> yes, he did. Yes, he did. And uh, so Kane and Lovin go out to finish the last 24 seconds of the penalty, so it'll be four on four, and then we'll take over for about a minute 40 of penalty. Kane's got it. Kane grabs it and skates it out, poked away by the Wichita Thunder. And comes back to Zahn Werner, and he centers it, oh, back to Wichita. Offside. But that's going to be offside. So no harm, no foul on that one. <clears throat> like to see a little bit more careful possession of the puck there. 13 seconds on the penalty. 
7.36 left to go in a 2-2 game. Puck is in the dot right in front of us outside of the spirit zone. Kane to take the drop. And here's the puck. Kane gets some possession. Lovin pokes it away, and he's going to chase it to the blue line. Picked up by Kane. Lovin got there. Kane's got the puck. He goes behind the net looking for a centering shot. Takes a shot. Goes wide. Picked up at the blue line by Zahn Werner. Zahn Werner back to Lovin. Lovin can't catch it. Picked up by Kane. Kane down on his ice, on his knees, but he's still fighting for it. As a matter of fact, he still has possession. Lovin pokes his stick in there, manages to get it. Kane puts a body on Thunder. Picked up by Lovin. Lovin pokes it out. Oh, picked up by Lovin. Here's the Kane. Kane with a shot. Again, kind of lackadaisical yeah. play by both of the Actually, teams. The Thunder player but, overskates it. Yeah. Just left it there for the Spirit. Worked it in front. Yep. From first a shot bad the, angle there off the stick of Tyler Kane. That's our first shot of the period there by the Spirit, which is a long time to play, skate without getting a shot off. So we are on a power play now. White jersey line out there. Worth goes out to join them. Good nice job by man. Brown there to pick up this pick up the uh, puck at the blue line. Picked up by Lovin on the cross ice centering pass. Comes back to Werner. Werner's skating it in. Looks for a shot. Oh, in traffic. What in traffic. Good glove. Great job there by Zahn to work himself into a shooting lane. Gets the shot off and it makes its way through. But as you said, just yeah. what, a, what a job by the goaltender to pick yeah. that up in traffic. That was a good one. Going to give him credit for that. <clears throat> Puck gets one back to the Wichita Thunder. They send it the length of the ice, and they have a chaser coming hard, but Zahn Werner's going to take it around behind the net. He's going to wait to set it up. Brings it over here to Tyler Kane. Tyler Kane's got it at the red line, up to Lovin. Lovin in the zone. He's got help. Sends it to, oh, my goodness. Lovin to Worth the Kane. That is a great, great combination. Kelly, that may have been one of the prettiest goals we've seen all year long. And they put play. in some good ones. What an absolute beautiful goal. Started in the spirit zone on a great outlet pass from Zahn Werner. Spirit worked the puck forward and tic-tac-toe, boom, and it's in the back of the net on the tap-in. You know, let's let's give everybody assists for that oh one. Give out five assists. That was a beautiful, that was a beautiful beauty. sequence. So the Spirit regained their one goal lead with 6.18 to go in the third period, a power play goal. Yeah, Kane with the goal. Yeah. Carden takes the puck, or takes the drop. Brady skates it in, gets a shot off. Bracket putting a little pressure on it, crashing for the rebound, smothered by the Wichita goalie. So we're gonna have a drop to the right of the goalie. Major Carden bobs his head to the music as he's wont to do. <laughs> Spirit stacks the center lane and up and out of the playing surface by the uh, Wichita Thunder. So we are back to full strength. Spirit take a quick lead. Yeah, and uh, I think we've been in this situation before where it's late in the game and we've got to protect this one goal lead and really got to tighten things down defensively at this point. Poked away by Wichita. Oh, can't quite keep it in. Brady Allen just sends it back in. Wisely deep into the zone. Pressure by Brackett. Picked up. Kept in by Wheeler at the blue line. Picked up by Brackett. Centers it, but picked up by... Uh-oh, a little bit of a breakaway by the oh. Wichita Thunder, and Calvin Wheeler does a great job of picking up and back-checking and defending that. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Centering pass tipped by the Wichita Thunder, sent in from the near side. Just can't get good wood on it to turn and spin and shoot. Kale Parker manages to get his leg out. Sorry. Tell you what, just uh, once again, credit to Thunder for just working battle in front of the spirit net. Yeah, yeah, and they, they are, are strong uh, and, and solid and uh, they can work that. You know, they, and, they, they send it in and they expect someone to be there. All right. Drop is taken by Zahn Werner, comes to the near side, picked up by Life. Life tries to bounce off the back, goes behind the net. Daniger comes to pick it up, still in possession by the Thunder. They come out to the blue line. He winds up. Andrew Johnson with a good block, dangerously going down in front of that. 
Picked up by Zahn Werner over to Andrew Johnson. Ticked up to the Thunder. Thunder turning Five around, bring it in. Here comes the Thunder, tipped away by Life. Nice job. Centering pass up into the air, way up in the air. Picked up by the Thunder on the drop of the uh, Oh, trip by, <laughs> we're not gonna get a trip on that, okay. No call. I'm, uh, I'm impressed. And here comes Zahn Werner off of a tip by Andrew Johnson. Zahn Werner looking for it. Oh, how did that not go in? How did that not oh, go it in? Oh, like it was in. Oh my gosh. That is, uh, that should have been a goal, folks. Great shot by Zahn Werner and no goal. So we're gonna Let's hope that doesn't see that uh, one. Factor. But Puck is still in the zone, and Zahn Werner is uh, looking for a call by the ref, turned by Zahn Werner's got it, and we have a trip call, finally, all right. Well, a consolation there yep. for the Spirit as they draw the penalty, but Zahn Werner boy, staying like down. A replay of that shot from Werner. Zahn as Werner it, goes down hard on that trip. Certainly looked like it was in the back of the net, deflected. It sure did. And We'll get a look, at, I'm sure, uh, after the game. Oh, yeah. On the, uh, the, oh, yeah. The behind the goal camera. We'll see if we can get a definitive answer uh, there. But Let's keep production. Is going to turn now. that. He's going to let us know on that one. All right, so we've got the Love and Kane and Worth line out. 4.07 left in the game. We're on a power play one line. Daniger and Brown out at the blue line. And sent into the corner here. Fought in by the Wichita Thunder. Picked up by... Worth, Worth sends it in, tipped out to the corner. Picked up, one-timer by Daniger, tipped away by Wichita, poked away by Worth, great effort by Worth. Picked up by Kane, Kane to Daniger, I'm sorry, to Lovin. Lovin shoots it in, gloved by the goalie. <laughs> great work there by the Spirit on this power play. One, first one coming from Daniger, the one-timer. And then worked in front to love him. He's able to get good wood on it, too. <laughs> a little theatrics by the goalie there. He knew he had made a good good grab. Worth to take the, dra the drop on this one. Comes back to Daniger. Daniger's got the deep angle. Oh, tries to get over to Kane in the high crease and can't quite grab that pass. Good pass by Daniger. Really smart move. Picked up by Daniger behind the net. Wichita putting a little pressure on. Here comes Wichita. Daniger's going to take it. He's got the stride. Tipped by Worth. Worth's got a little room. He's got one person to beat. Oh, nifty little backhand there looking for it. Had the wide open hole there. Not a call there. And we've got another chance out here. Drop back to Brown. Brown for the shot. Goes wide. Picked up again by Lovin. Lovin in the corner. He sends that one off. Fights off the check. Excellent job by Gavin Lovin. And he's going to get a chance at a shot here. Oh, tipped away by the glove. Uh, the goalie comes back out to the blue line. Snagged by Daniger. Daniger sends it down the blue line. Picked up by John Brown. John Brown takes it deep in. He's got no one there to quite help him, and it goes the length of the ice, so we've got a full line change. So we've got Brady Allen, Andrew Johnson, Carden. Bussin goes onto the ice. Gage Robb. Johnson brings it up the near side. He's got... Room poked away by Wichita. Johnson comes back up with it. He's looking for the centering pass. Can't get wood on it. Major Carden manages to tip it towards the goalie. And Rob gets oh. his hands on it, but no goal. Once again, the puck just tantalizingly Carden laying in the slides it over. Rob manages to poke in there and get a shot, but the goalie Boy, gets over. I thought once he gathered that puck up, he was going to be able to bury it. But I did too. Goalie able to make the save. Ooh -wee. Keeping this one goal game, three to two. Seven seconds to go in the Wichita penalty. Interesting line here, low Kallenberger Werner. They stack the crease out to Brady Allen. Bounces out to Bussin. Bussin sends it into the corner. Picked up by Kallenberger. Full strength. And Wichita's now got the puck. They try to get it out. Can't get it out. Bounce around at the blue line. Can't get possession. Wichita comes up with it. Takes it in, bodied by Bussin. Oh, great outlet pass by Parker. Big shot over the top of the goal. Bussin fighting for it behind the back of the net. Bussin goes to his knees on the big hit. 
Picked up by John Brown in the corner. Back behind the net by Wichita. Wichita's looking to center it. Bussin on one skate, does a great job. Outlet pass to Lowe. Lowe can't quite handle it there with a the big hit. Uh-oh, picked up by Werner. Now Werner's got some open ice and he's got Lowe with him. He's got one man to beat and he's gonna take the shot. Lowe was crashing the net. Picked up on the near side by Kallenberger. Kallenberger fighting in the near corner. Helped by Lowe. Picked up by Werner out on the dash. He sends it towards the net. Ooh, dangerous tip by the Wichita player up into the top shelf. Kept in by Brady Allen. Brady, they send it the length of the ice. Picked up by Nick Daniger in his own zone. He's got a little room. Oh, somebody tried to stand up to Nick Daniger and they didn't have the mass for that. Poked away by the Spirit, still kept by the Wichita player in the, in the neutral zone. They send it deep into the zone, goes behind the net, picked up by Worth. Worth takes it, and Worth has got a little bit of room. Worth just sends it into the neutral zone, picked up by Wichita. Picked up now by Werner. Werner's got someone to chase. Gavin Lovin in the far blue line. He skates it in. He's got no one with him. He's got Worth coming in. Oh, tipped by Wichita. A little bit of a lackadaisical skate there, Kurt. Yeah, finally able to get the uh, goaltender to the bench with now just 13 seconds to go. And, and one good there clear. There we go, there That's we go. It. Five seconds left, empty net. Empty net and uh, Spirit come away with a win. Big wow. win on the home turf for the uh, Wichita Thunder. You bet, huge win on a beautiful goal to win this one. I can't wait to go back and take a look at that yeah, one in the replay. Yeah. But what a solid effort uh, overall. You know, three different three different goal scorers, three different line scoring. That's a team effort. And uh, yeah, that last one was worthy of the game winner. A beautiful goal. Both teams doing a good job of being good sportsmen, tapping sticks at each other. Couple of quick uh, haze and goodbyes, and we'll see you tomorrow morning, folks. You bet. Happy New Year, and when's our game tomorrow? 9 a.m. Ne next game is at 9.30 a.m. tomorrow, back here at the Wichita Ice Palace, we've decided. <laughs> we'll see you tomorrow. For Kurt Bussin, Brad Allen, and Scott Lutzke, thanks for tuning in.